Okay, so here we go. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode, gameplay, and live stream of Final Fantasy X. I'm RDH Davis, and we're going to explore Besaid Island. This is Waka's home, and uh, what are we, we going to do? Let me see. I can't confuse this with Final Fantasy X, because you know how I told you guys in the last episode? Ah, look, there it is. I guess you can, because I was going to say... There's also some hidden areas in Final Fantasy X2 that you can explore when you come and revisit these places. Things that you couldn't get to in this game. Let me see. Oh my god! I was like, what's going on here? Hello! <gasps> Potions! How much money do we have? A thousand! A hundred and ten dollars! I'll buy one. Thank you very much. Thank you, come again. Ah. Uh, nope, that's it. Lady, your butt cheeks are showing. <laughs> I heard the sin toxin got to you. Took your memory, eh? What's sin? How could you forget sin? I can't say I don't envy you, though. There's many who would give anything to forget the pain sin has brought. Sin appeared a thousand years ago, a raging demon intent to reducing Spira to rubble. Everyone in Spira lives under the sin's black shadow. But to forget sin? Well, I'd consider yourself lucky, eh? Well, I don't think... It matters because if you see sin again, well, memory will come back. What's toxin? The foul va vapors that boil from the sin's from sin's hide are evil indeed. One breath of it, and it will taint the very core of your body. People who get too close to sin forget even the most important things. <gasps> oh, that's terrible. Well, how long does it last? Just like you, eh? What's Yevon? How wretched you, <laughs> wretched you must be to have forgotten the techniques of Yevon. The, te the, the teachings are the only salvation for those who suffer because of sin. I'm sure you followed the, the teachings before the toxin got to you, of course. Go pray at the temple and all will, all will return in time. Xanarkin, we already know. Uh, no thanks, Gramps. There's Waka Waka. Go present yourself to the temple summoner before we eat, yeah? <gasps> the temple summoner, guys. <gasps> we gotta meet the temple summoner. And from the name of it, yes. The summoner can summon the Aeons, the ones that we were able to do summon from Final Fantasy VII. However, hey, hey, hey. However, in this game, uh, yeah, I think it's only in this Final Fantasy game, if I'm not mistaken. Only the summoner is allowed to summon the Aeons. The rest of us, we can't. Titus and all the other characters, I don't think, no, they can't summon. It's only the summoner. <gasps> and now I'm starting to remember how much I relied on that summoner to summon the monster, the, the Aeons. Like Shiva. Uh, what were the other ones? Wait, the mainlanders love the fruit, whatever. Yo, Jimbo. All the other ones. Okay, I guess we could go in here now. And then we could go to the temple. These guys. Hello. Hey, you. You what? were attacked by Sin, right? Yes. Recently, was it? Yes. I think so. So, Sin can't be far, right? You're not hiding anything, are you? <laughs> Why would I? If Sin's nearby, it'll attack the island for sure. But it hasn't. I wonder why. I'm sorry. I really don't know anything. To tell the truth, I uh, don't even know what the Crusaders are. You're kidding, right? Sin, the toxin. Gotta tell him who we are. Yes, sir. The Crusaders are sworn to battle Sin. We have chapters throughout Spira, accepting all who wish to join our struggle. The hero Meehan formed the Crusaders 800 years ago as the Crimson Blades. 
Later, our ranks grew and we called ourselves the Crusaders. We've been fighting sin ever since. What? You've been fighting 800 years and you still haven't beat it? <laughs> uh, 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 well, we steered sin away from towns many times. And that's all we can do. Nobody's ever been able to defeat it. Our mission as Crusaders is to protect the temples, towns, villages, and people of Spira. So, then whose job is it to defeat Sin? Is Sin's toxin really this bad, sir? It does seem rather bad. We could just tell you, but I think it better for you to try and remember. Go pray at the temple. Perhaps Yevon will help you regain your memory. Oh, no, maybe later. I'll take a nap later. But there is a... Look at the kitty! Look at the... The weird-looking kitty. Kind of looks like... What's his face? Red. Kind of looks like his... Oh, look! Another one right here! Look at how cute! Cutie! What does she do? Why is her hair like that? Huh. Anyways, it looks like red. A little mini red. To be oh my god, he looks like... What's his face? <gasps> he looks like um, this guy right here. He looks like Wedge. From Final Fantasy VII. Aw, Wedge. He didn't have to die like that. That was awful when they explained what, ha what happened to him. All right, so we're going to go into the temple, guys. We're going to pray. We're going to pray. So for 800 years, guys. Those crusaders have been fighting against sin, and they have yet to defeat it. Imagine. It was then, standing in that place. I began to realize how different this world was from my own. Is that guy? Oh. <clears throat> Ten years have passed since Lord Braska became High Summoner. And finally, we receive a statue for our temple. Well, what's a High Summoner? <laughs> Oh my god! Uh, I, I got too close to Sin's uh, toxin. Oh my god, having to use that excuse all the damn time. It was funny hearing myself make the same excuse over yeah. and over. Funny and a little sad. Mm -hmm. The summoners are practitioners of a sacred art, sworn to protect the people of Yevon. Only a chosen few become summoners, who call forth entities of great power, the Aeons. The Aeons hear our prayers and come down to us. They are the blessing of Yevon. So what he meant... ...was that we should respect some kind of great men, or something like that, I feel. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let me see what's in here. Before we go, visit the High Summoner. No treasure chest. Oh my god, nothing? No treasure chest? No nothing. Pray hard, and the toxin will surely release its grip on you. Yeah, yeah. Wait. Only sworn guardians may approach the the cloister of trials. Oh, I, we can't. Okay, never mind. So then what? We just leave? 
But we needed to talk to the high. Wait, wait, wait. We did. Wait, wait, did we pray? I think we did pray. I hope we prayed. Well, we prayed with that dude. So now what? Uh oh. Am I in those moments where I don't know what to do next? Sorry, man. No time for lunch yet. Take oh. a nap. You look pushed. Oh, that's it? Oh, okay. Uh, thanks. Yeah, I'll take a nap here. Thank you very much. You want to cuddle, cuddle with me? <gasps> you could at least go see how they are doing. We can't interfere. It's a rule. But it's been nearly... <clears throat> but it's been nearly it's been nearly a day already perhaps you could go look for us people are searching for him now thank you who cares whether he comes back or not but he might die. Fine, let him. Oh. Do you... Do you hate him so? But if he dies, you'll never be able to tell him how much you hate him. Waka? Waka Waka? Waka? Uh, save. Sorry guys, the reason why I keep saving is because I don't want to go through all those cutscenes again. Oh, by the way, guys, so I finally got a haircut, too. I forgot to mention that. I finally got a haircut. Now that I cut my hair short, I'm going to start working on a little... You know how on Twitch, in the main in, uh, the main page of the streamer, they have a little commercial or something for you, like a little trailer for you that explains what they do, who they are, and all that? I'm going to start working on that. And I hope it turns out good. And more emotes, of course, will be coming up soon. Of course, of course. Just haven't had enough time. Is something wrong? What's going on? The summoner hasn't returned from the trial. Eh? Eh? No, apprentice summoner, really. Huh? There's a room in there called the Cloister of Trials. Beyond is where the apprentice summoner prays. If the prayer is heard, the apprentice becomes a fully-fledged summoner. Remember? Uh, so someone is in there somewhere, and they haven't come back out. Right, I got it. <laughs> A day's already gone by. Is it particularly dangerous in there? Sometimes, yes. Why don't you go in and help? There's already guardians in there. Besides, it's forbidden. Uh-oh. Hey, but what if something happens? What if the summoner dies? The precepts must be obeyed. Like I care. <gasps> oh my god! Maybe this wasn't such a good idea after all. <laughs> oh my Yevon! He's breaking the rules! The Cloister of Trials. Those who seek to learn of Yevon's secret arts are tested by the Cloister of Trials. Find the right way and you will be taken to the Chamber of the Faith. Examine objects with X to open the to open the way a strange glyph gl glows touch the glyph Oh 
my god. Okay, so I should let you guys know about this. So there will be other temples that we ha will have to explore when we go visit other cities, other towns. Um, and each temple has a secret treasure chest that we need to find. If you find every single treasure chest in every temple, uh, towards the all the way towards the end, you will get to, you will get the chance to get a special secret Aeon. Uh -uh, that's very good. That's very powerful Aeon. <clears throat> and boy, when I learned about that, I was it was it was too late. I was already far up ahead, but I did not know I had to find every single treasure chest. Something can be wait. What? Say that again. The door seems to be locked by an unseen force. Something can be placed in, in this reset. Okay. You must be a wait. You must use a sphere to go any further. Glyph spheres can open the way to chamber of the faith. Destruction spheres open the way to hidden. Yes, the hidden treasure. So we need the destruction sphere. It seems that the Sate spheres are also necessary. Is that it? Oh, okay. So I removed the glyph spear. You can carry only one spear at a time. Yeah, so I was saying when I first played this game and I found out that, oh, you could get this secret Aeon, but you had to find every single treasure, I was already like at the end where I was like, oh man. I think if I'm not mistaken, there are three hidden Aeons that you can get that are very powerful. One I was able to get, but the other two, I couldn't. I couldn't. You see a sphere shape. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let me see. Touch the symbols. So you can imagine I had to replay it again. Oh. <gasps> Beautiful. A Besaid Sphere. Can I touch it? No. Now let's see if I remember how to do this. Nope, nothing happened. Whoa! Wait, 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 wait. Move the pedestal set with with a spear to the correct place. If you move it improperly, step on the... Wait, if you move it improperly, step on the shining glyph to return to the... Return the pedestal to its original place. Oh, I see it, I see it, I see it. Now, hold on, I'm not done yet because I want to get that hidden treasure. And let's see if I can if I remember how to do it. Hopefully it won't be too hard. <gasps> oh yes! The destruction sphere. Yes. Now remember the destruction spheres reveal to you the hidden treasure. It gets harder at the other temples to figure out how to... Oh! And we're gonna get them all. I, won't, I may not be able to do 100% completion of this game. Like to get the legendary weapons. Oh lord. Rod of Wisdom. 
You can obtain hidden items by using destruction spheres. Um, okay, anyways. Yeah, you could also get secret weapons and get like items that you can combine combine them with. Hey. Oh. It's gotten into you. Hey, it's okay. Only summoners, apprentice summoners, and their guardians can enter here. It's a tradition, very important. So what about you? Me? I'm a guardian. A guardian? Whoa, whoa, ah! Summoners uh -oh. go on a pilgrimage to pray at every temple in Spira. Guardians protect them. The Guardian's in there now. One of them's got a short fuse. And who knows what the other's thinking. <laughs> well, now that we've come this far. I know who he's talking about. Might as well go all the way. What are you doing here? Didn't think we'd be able to handle it. No, it's, uh, it's just... See, I told you she gets mad easy. <laughs> and she's my favorite character, guys. Oh, look, and there's the other cat. Is the summoner all right? <sighs> Who are you? She's my favorite character in this game. Beautiful voice. <gasps> and then there's the other character. Her eyes are pretty. <clears throat> one's blue and one's green. Imagine. Man, was I surprised. And here I was thinking summoners were all old geezers. I forgot to mention the reason why I got this game. Not only because I remember the character from Kingdom Hearts, which was Tidus, and he comes out in the, in the cover of Final Fantasy X. But when I saw the guidebook, the strategy guidebook, one day at Target, I was looking at it, and I was looking at the, the pictures and the drawings of the, of the main characters. And then that's when I saw the woman in the black dress. I was like, oh, who's she? I'm like, is she a villain? Whoever she is, I loved her outfit. And I'm like, how the hell? Once you get a better look at her outfit, I don't know if you guys saw, but... She has like a bunch of belts wrapped around her legs. It's like a bunch. I don't know how the hell she walks. So, yes, I don't know how these characters can hold their breath for underwater for such a long time. How they can talk underwater and how could they do some of their stuff. And how this woman who has like a bunch of belts wrapped around her legs. I don't know how the hell she could walk. Putting your transgression aside for wait, putting your transgression aside for now. Let us celebrate the birth of a summoner. Eh, kiss my edge. We'll get their names. I don't want to say their names yet, but... Hey, over here. Where? <gasps> oh. So there he is, guys. This is the other talking cat. But as you can see, he is not a kitty. He is a lion. But he's cool, though. He is cool. Where are you? Oh. What? I, 
Ah! Ow! Wait till you see this. I can't see anything. <laughs> Ready. Okay. So this is the character there that's kind of like Aerith from Final Fantasy VII. But question is, who would you prefer? This character or Aerith? I had never seen anything like it in my life. Sure, it was a little scary, but still, I could feel a strange kind of gentleness coming from it. So this is what? Valifor. Let me see. No, I'm not gonna change its name. You could also give nicknames to your Aeons, but nah. I like their names. Proceed, yes. I remember that night we talked for the first time. <gasps> I didn't know it then, but after that night, everything changed for everyone, for me. Why? Let me introduce you to the team. This guy here wants into the tournament so bad, I let him on the team. <laughs> His memory's a little fuzzy, so don't mind him if he says anything odd. Come on, say hi. He's like he really wanted to be in the team. <laughs> uh, hi guys. Hi. Uh -huh. So what's our goal? <laughs> to do our best! <laughs> nope, we got a new goal now. Our new goal is victory! To win every match, defeat every opposing team, to bring the Crystal Cup back to our island. That's all we need to do to win. Easy, huh? Victory! 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 He's got his eyes set on something else. Everyone's acting like we already won. Not that I can blame them, yeah. You sure got the boys worked up, huh? You sure got the bo Oh, okay. Now let's go talk to Yuna, shall we, guys? You heathen! Stay away from the summoner! You're a bad man! Oh, <laughs> damn! Lady Yuna, be careful. But it was really my fault to begin with. For what? I'm Yuna. Thank you so much for your help earlier. Huh? Uh, I'm sorry about that. Wasn't that... Wasn't I not supposed to... Guess I kind of overreacted. Oh, no. I was overconfident. Um, I saw that Aeon thing. That's amazing. Uh, really? Do you think I can become High Summoner? Lady Yuna, come play with me some more. So, tomorrow then. Tomorrow? We're going on the same boat, aren't we? Oh, really? We can talk more. Huh. 
Hmm. You can tell me all about Sanerkind. <clears throat> She's cute, yeah. Oh my god. Uh Yeah. Don't get no ideas. No promises there, big guy. Hey, but what if she like comes on to me? That's not going to happen. If you get tired, let me know. I had a bed made for you. I he makes it sound like I'm not going to let it happen. Stay away from the summoner. Okay. Stay away from the summoner. <laughs> Stay Okay, okay. I remember I used to do that a lot. <laughs> mm, ready for bed. Uh, not quite yet. Don't overdo it. We leave early tomorrow. Okay, okay. Hold on. Uh, do I save my progress? Stay away from the summon. Oh my god, I'm over here, lady. Calm down. Well, I guess there's nowhere else to go, right? No, I guess that's it. Just talk to him. Mm, ready for bed. Yes. Good. Sleep tight. Stay away from the summoner. Man, do these people not have blankets? In Final Fantasy Seven, everywhere. Wait, what's going on here? Oh, we're having a dream. <gasps> There's Yuna. Ooh, this is a good dream. Oh, shit. Okay, never mind. <gasps> this could be a good dream, guys. There she is. Shh. Where's, Where's that, that boat? boat? Everyone will find us if it doesn't, doesn't come, come soon. soon. You really, really sure, sure this, this is okay? okay? Oh, my God. Would you take me to Xanarkand? Hey! You said you'd go with me! Haha! <laughs> oh, hey! I, uh... I thought Waka told you not to get any ideas. <laughs> I don't know why he was running. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so you're coming with me. Hey, stop dreaming! You, with a woman, you can't even catch a ball! Oh? Oh, what's the matter? Gonna cry again, cry, cry. That's the only thing you're good for. I hate you. Huh? What'd you say? You have to speak loudly. I hate you! Huh? Spirit. You, you can, can do, do it. it. Oh my god. I hate you! <laughs> He's dead, okay? Dead. Surprised I didn't wake up the people next to him. He does look a lot like Chapu. I was surprised too, the first time I saw him. But no matter what he looks like, he isn't Chapu. You shouldn't have brought him here in the first place. Yeah, but he needed our help. Excuses again? Yeah, but... That's it. No more. Enough, Waka. Scary. <laughs> so, who's Chapu? My little brother, Chapu. He looked like you. He's dead? He was with the Crusaders when they fought Sin last year. He didn't make it. I first heard on the day of the tournament. Oh, so that's why. I became a guardian to fight sin, yeah? Revenge, yeah. then? That was the idea. But 
I'm more worried about a stupid game now than avenging my brother. Well, after the next tournament, I'll be a guardian full time. I know it kind of looks like I'm using you, but I'm not. Hmm. Don't worry. I mean, I owe you a lot. You really helped me out, you know? What I mean is... Thanks, Waka. <laughs> Stop. You're embarrassing me. <laughs> Good morning. A whole new day guys and we are going we're leaving <gasps> uh oh hey sleepy head something I want to give you whoa you're giving this to me ah yeah, use it well this is the sword that he has in the cover of Final Fantasy X it's a nice sword that's the sword you gave Chapu well <gasps> he never used it <clears throat> Where's Yuna? We're taking the same boat as Yuna, right? Why do we gotta wait here? Yuna came to this village ten years ago, when the last calm started. The calm? Since then, she's been like a little sister to me and Lulu. But she had the talent. She became an apprentice. Now, today, she leaves as a summoner. This is our journey. We should leave together. Hmm. You really don't need all that luggage. Uh, they're not really my things. Th they're gifts for the temples we're to visit. This isn't a vacation, you know. <laughs> I guess... I guess you're right. Ah, uh, using the Tron. Hey, what's going on? Something I want to give you. Unzips pants. Okay, oh! here we go. How's it going, using the Tron? Aww. Oh, Yuna. And she just left her luggage there. Somebody's gonna come and like, oh, free clothes! <clears throat> Wish I could have been here from the start, but I was waiting for a girl to stream. <gasps> Princess Peach! But she didn't. Aww. <gasps> you, uh, you were down to, to watch a gameplay of Princess Peach using the Tron? And you're doing good? Or free trophies. Ah. Okay, hold on. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Here comes one now. Hey, <gasps> why don't you try out that sword I gave you? Sure. No problem. Not too shabby. You kept up with him pretty well. Might make a good guardian someday. A flyer, my kind of customer. So basically, this tutorial is teaching you like which characters can handle flying type Pokemon and which characters can handle ground type Pokemon. <laughs> Are you going to do the? Maybe someday. I don't have the game yet, but. I'm just waiting to hear like if it's a really good game to play, like fun and with a good story and you know has some action and all that good stuff, and not just cute for kids or something, then I'll get it. You know what I mean? Because if it's cute and just meant for kids, then I'll be like, eh, then you know, it's not for me then. But when I heard about the game Princess Peach, I was like, oh man, I want, I want to, I want to get a Princess Peach game. Ha, watch this! Oh my god, you can see right through it. I don't remember it being like that in the original. That's gross. What is it? Like its brain or the meat? Oh! <gasps> Told you, only magic can beat that thing. 
If you can't beat them down, you gotta use magic of an element they don't like. Magic? Element? Let's have our black mage show you what I mean. Oh, here she comes. You're up. Clueless, aren't you? Good thing I'm here. Elements. Magic and fiends have uh, properties called elements. There are four. There are four elements: fire, ice, lightning, and water. Fire and ice are opposed, as are lightning and water. Spells of ice work well against fire fiends, and ice fiends are weak against fire magic. You follow? I get fire yeah. and ice, but what about lightning and water? Lightning and water are opposed, just like fire and ice. This one here is a water fiend, which means. Look at her costume. Look, look what I told you. She has all those belts. How the hell can she walk? I have no clue. Don't ask me. I think it depends how you use it. Wait. Wait. I think it depends how you use it then. Uh, but in my opinion, it was pretty much worth watching. Was it? It's a good game. You didn't get kid. Oh, okay. All right. So that's a, oh, a water type, right? So that means... It's weak against electric. Boom! Hey, boys. Eyes up here. Okay. Now, hold on. Well, if it... If I hear... If I keep hearing good stuff about the game, uh, Izutron, then maybe I'll get it in the future. Yuna. Mo no, I don't think we can do anything yet. Lulu. Nope, nothing yet either. Waka waka. There we go. Stop looking at my belts. Eyes up here on my breasts. <laughs> my chicken breasts. But use of the Tron, come on now. Come on now. Where am I going? Davis. Okay, now we're getting more and more characters to join the party. Do you like this this Final Fantasy game, Use of the Tron? Take your time. Oh. Let's get going, man. Hey. We're gonna wait. Huh? Yeah. All right. You ready? <laughs> yeah, I like it too. Use the Tron. It's one of my favorites, and it's the first Final Fantasy game I started. What's going on? My first Final Fantasy game. But it's definitely too hyped when people say it's the best. Oh, no, I wouldn't say it's the best. When I learned about Final Fantasy VII and then VIII and so on, I'm like, oh, no. Which is, that's why I like, I, I've never played Nine, but I'm interested in playing it because I heard a lot of people, they like that one, too. So I'm like, ooh. And it seems like they haven't failed so far. I did like the story of eight. It's an ancient custom. People leaving the island pray here for a safe trip. Chapu didn't pray that day. Said he'd miss his boat. Hmm. I think the reason why they say it's the best use of the Trump because those two melons, those huge melons you see right there, I think that's probably why. And also uh, because Waka, you know. I think they like that he throws his ball. I'm just kidding. I love the beginning, then some parts gets boring. Yeah. Because I will say in the beginning it was like kind of like slow. But then as I like make progress, I was like, okay, finally we're getting some good, interesting stuff. Like the part when you learn the story, the truth about the pilgrimage, and then about Yevin, and a whole bunch of tr stuff. It's like, oh my god. The drama. 
I love this game though. I prefer the original because the remaster was. Yeah, I, I, you see the Tron. Thank you for saying that. I also agree. When I played the the remastered versions, I also noticed that. Hold on. So when I played the remastered versions, I noticed that the characters' faces did look different. I thought, oh, Titus's face looks pretty good. But then when I saw Yuna's, I'm like, I don't know. I felt like in the original, she had better facial expressions. This one, she barely like smiles or anything. <laughs> Hold on. She barely smiles or anything. But I still love it. You know what? I'm thinking I should probably just save it here. Because, let me see, we were exploring, yeah, I'm going to save it here. So, for those of you who are watching me live on my Twitch, stay tuned guys, we're going to keep going with this adventure of Final Fantasy X, and for my viewers on YouTube, they'll be watching this sometime in the future. Thanks guys so very much for watching, hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys, and those of you who've already played it, hope you guys enjoy going down memory lane with me of Final Fantasy X. And we'll see you guys next time. Y'all take care, have a good day or a good night. And don't forget to save your progress whenever you're playing your video games. Laters, everybody.